All right, post practice on Thursday, and uh, boy, it's good to see this guy in uniform and participating. Darius Moorhead, who is a freshman last season in the first couple of games, showed so much promise and then had the concussion, and we didn't see him on the field again the rest of the year. So I guess, Darius, first thing of, of all the the, uh, the the drudgery and everything that goes into practice, you probably are the most happiest guy uh, on this team to be in pads and going through it right now. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. it feels really good to be back. Um, thank the Lord that I'm back. Thank God. Um, just going through spring, it felt really good. My legs were fresh. Um, new coach staff, so I had to learn a new playbook. Glad the concussion was out of the way so I could actually learn it. But um, it just feels really good to be back, training camp and everything. Tell me about last season because, again, you got off to such a promising start. You, you, you showed out well at Michigan State in the opener. and and things are going well in, in week two. Do you remember the play that you went out on? I would never forget the play, but last season, was, it was a great season going through camp, feeling good, earning the starting spot, and then just getting hit with the barrier. It's life. You got to go through it. Just continue to trust in God, and that's what I did, and pushed me on through the season. Got me back to training camp, got me back to spring. So it was a tough year last year, but I got through. T tell me about the play. The play, well, it was a swing pass. It was a, I know it was at the end of the second half, uh, I called it, turned up field. I really couldn't go anywhere. I had corner, safety, and linebacker coming for me. I just wanted to get the first down so I can get a field goal range to end the half. So I just tried to skirt, squirt through there, and then one guy, he speared me, helmet to helmet, and I was out. At, at that juncture, did you have any notion that it was going to cost you the rest of the season? No notion. No notion. I thought I would just be out the game or the next game, but the, uh, the symptoms just kept Recurring, recurring. So I just hung it up. Was there a point toward the end of last year where you could have played, and they decided just to go ahead and hold you out and redshirt you? Um, yes, sir. There was a point, but I was still having some symptoms, mm -hmm. and so by that time it was already really, really late in the season. So why not just hang it up, redshirt me, come back for another season? What'd you do in the off season? In the off season, I just made sure I was um, getting back healthy. I went through mat drills and everything. I got back lifting and just got back in the groove. They, they don't take any chances these days with concussions, do they? I mean, the protocol's pretty right. pretty stringent. Oh, yes, and I think they shouldn't take any chances with concussions because the stuff that's coming out now is pretty serious, and I think a lot of precautions should be taken. So it's really good that all those precautions are there. So tell, tell me how things are going through nine practices. Through nine practices, things are going good. You can see you were out here today. You can see we're pushing, doing pretty good. I know it's the second week. We were probably looking a little dead today, but we're, we're getting better. We're getting better. We're getting ready for Walford. We're getting ready to go to Spartanburg. And we're, I just believe in us. Everybody believes in us. You can see the, it's a new field on the practice on the practice um, field, and just feels good. You, you, you like the multifaceted aspect of this offense? Yes, sir. I do like it. Um, going through it for the spring, you know, it was an offense I've never been in before. Being in the wing is different. I'm always used to outside zone, inside zone, but we do a lot of that too. Mm -hmm. which is pretty good, and I love it. Is there a lot of competition at the running back spot? A lot of competition. I would say it is a lot of competition, but a lot of competition that's going to play. Mm -hmm. All of us are back there. We can play in Wofford, play all 12 games, however many games we have. We can all play. Even our freshman, Devin Wynn, he's looking pretty good, pretty hefty, and he can get through there. Sounds like you're ready to get going now. Yes, sir. All right. Thank you, man. Thank you.